Hi, this is Rain from My Service Depot. In this video, we're going to discuss using the equipment feature from within iFleet. iFleet allows you to update existing customer equipment as well as add new pieces for your customers. Select the Equipment button in the left panel of the job screen. At the top right corner, click the plus symbol to add additional equipment. You can use the keyboard to name a new piece or select an item from your drop down list. The description field will allow you to enter further information to identify the new equipment, while the notes field further down can be used to add more detailed notes such as service requirements. If available, serial and model numbers can also be added. Using the barcode scanner in either one of these fields will allow you to scan and capture these codes. These can also be typed manually using the keyboard. Adding information to the location field will help further identify your equipment, especially for locations with multiple units. Using the keyboard, you can enter a new location, or by selecting the arrow, select from an existing location. iFleet also allows you to add the GPS coordinates by hitting the balloon on the right side of the location field. These coordinates can also be used in the Smart Service Job Service Address field as a mappable address. If you're using the Equipment User Defined fields, you can enter the additional information you wish to track. This information will be stored per piece of equipment and can be updated as needed anytime a piece is serviced. Whether you're adding a new piece of equipment or servicing an existing unit, equipment can be added to the job level by attaching it to a labor or material item. Under Items, select Add Equipment. For the unit you wish to add to your invoice or indicate was serviced on this particular visit, Click the I to select the desired item from your line item list. Once you've selected the item, click the calculator to enter the quantity. Now that you've attached the equipment to the part or labor line item for the services performed, you will see the item added to your list with the equipment information populated in the description field. If needed, you can adjust any rates or quantities by clicking into the item and updating your information. For more tips and tricks, check out our wiki at smartservice.com/wiki.